Hello, my beautiful cancer friends. Thanks for being here with me again. There are some cards for you today. Doing uh, career finance spreads this week. All things in the realm of money, career finance, all that good stuff, abundance. Thanks for hitting that like button again, cancer. Appreciate you. All your support, all your likes, comments, subscribe. Love you guys. Can't do this without you, cancer. All right. My last source tell me. See and speak clearly from my cancer friends today. What cancer you seeing here? What they need to see in here out of this? In the realm of career and finances. Thank you, my gods. Can't do this without you. I'm going to cut up this beautiful deck here called Terror of the Divine. Get a nice read out here for cancer. See what's going on with their money situation. Looking for money, cancer. Career and finances. What we got? Out of cups, it's here. Water energy, Cancer Pisces Scorpio could be your energy. It's a card about movement. He brave looking night too, man. Brave looking night there. Looks like he's halfway out in the ocean almost. What's going on, Cancer? What you doing here, man? What you doing? Excited. The other lovers. Lovers card about choices and trust. Choices and trust. What's going on here? Is Cancer uh, making some career choices? Joe the lovers to justice. Libra energy. Be a card about bringing things back into balance in your financial world, Cancer. Exercising your choices to do so. What are we going on? Bleh. Excuse me. What do we got going on here, Cancer? What do we got? Yo, five cups is here. Five Cups is here. What's this about? You worried about something? Something got you feeling a little bit emotional? Maybe had you worried, I don't know, about your money situation, your job situation? What's going on here, Cancer? What's going on? Six Swords. What card about movement? Cancer getting in the boat, moving towards some kind of choice here. Got justice to the Five of Cups. I mean, bringing balance back into your uh, financial world, it looks like here, Cancer. A couple more of these Terror of the Divine on this. Six of Wands, that's a card about victory. Victory, normally after the Five of Wands battle, we're going to say it's uh, after the Five of Cups heartache here. About your money situation, whatever the hell it was, man. Whatever it was, Cancer. Got victory on it. Oh, there's Five of Pentacles. Five Pentacles, Cancer, were you a little broke? You've been struggling with money or something? Got justice here. Going to bring the situation back into balance for you. Whatever happened, whatever the heck's going on, Cancer. And you got choices here. And you got movement here. This six shows you moving away from that crap. Eight of Cups. It's going to also be a walking away energy. And this probably is. Be walking away from like a job, but it could also be, and what I'm feeling is you're walking away from like an old way of thinking about money, possibly. Maybe um, you're always feeling broke, but you're not as broke as you think. I don't know, Cancer. What's going on here? You're moving here. You're moving here. Ten Swords. You know, it's a card about an end of a cycle. End of a cycle of something here, Cancer. What do you got going on here? Is that what these choices are about? Making the choice to end the cycle of uh, financial struggle here. Maybe working on a business on the side or something. Yeah, you could be the fool's here. Fool's here at that night. That night, Cancer. Like I said, it's probably your energy in this. Going on a new journey. Going on a new journey. You might have been struggling a little bit with money. Decided you needed to add some to your pot. So you're going on a little new journey here. New exciting journey, maybe starting a business, maybe making some investments or something. What we got going on? Let's get the Spirit Song Terror out on this, please, for cancer. Interesting looking read. Lots of uh, movement going on here in the financial arena for cancer. Might have been worried about the finances in the recent past, but there's a uh, balance coming to that situation, whatever it was about. Don't see anything serious like losing a job or anything like catastrophic. Just, uh, See you working on uh, some kind of new project, maybe a business, maybe taking on a second job, bringing things back into balance somehow in your financial world, Cancer. 
Temperance is here. Another card about balance. You can also talk about patience. You can talk about patience. Maybe that's what the five's about. These fives over here. Let me put that right there with that five of pentacles. Another eight of cups. Definitely some movement going on here. Moving away, walking away from, uh, I think, a mindset. I think you're working on your financial mindset right now and trying to just generally attract in abundance. That's what I'm getting here, Cancer. And I does say you're working on something down here with the fool. Working on something down here with the fool going on. I ain't King of Swords here. It's about, it says logic and justice. You also have justice here. It's more air energy in this. It's a lot of balancing energy going on here. A lot of mental energy going on in your cancer. Let's say you're working on your mindset to me. You're ending like an old cycle with it. Ending an old cycle with your mindset here. You might have been stuck in some... Uh, Oh, stinking thinking about your finances for a while. It was Eight of Pentacles. Or sorry, Eight of Wands. More movement energy. This is the coming in hot energy, Cancer. The card about victory there, too. The Six of Wands. I'd say whatever it is you're working on manifesting in or whatever this project is that you're working on. I mean, it's, uh, it's going to come in together quick here. Come together quick. An old fire page. Does enthusiasm and discovery on it. Goes nice with that full energy there. That full's kind of an Aries energy and a Mercury energy. Let's say you're working on something new here, Cancer. You're working on new wealth here, new uh, financial opportunities, maybe a business, investment, something like that, man. I like what you're doing. Let me guys, uh, let me know in the comments, man, what y'all are working on. I love hearing from you guys. I'm always curious what's going on in your lives. Love you guys a lot. Get a uh, some yin yang oracles on this. Check that one out. The jumped here in just a second, Cancer. Top of it, it says till debt tears apart. Contracts, career, commitments. <laughs> Could be what that five pentacles was about there. Maybe you're working on paying off some old debt. And maybe that's what you're working on this new abundance for. I have some big plans here, Cancer. That's what it looks like to me. Probably got some big plans here right now. I like it, man. I like it. Get the masculine here. Sometimes you have to harness the masculine energy and uh, just get shit done. Just get shit done. Masculine doesn't have to be toxic. I know there's a lot of buzzwords in the media nowadays. That's why I don't watch the news or TV. It's really fucking poisonous for your brain. But um, sometimes you got to harness your masculine energy. You got to get shit done. I'm going to put this right here with that king. About logic and justice, man. But with that king, male or female, doesn't matter. Terror don't know gender. Terror knows energy. Let's grab a couple more of these yin-yang oracles, please. Truth and expression. I do think you might be looking at starting a business here. Maybe you got a debt situation that you feel like might have been holding you back. Or maybe you're getting a loan for a business and that's got you worried. Because there was some worry there with them two fives. But I don't think it's too much of a worry. Truth and expression here. Whatever this is you're working on is going to allow you to express your true self. And that's how you're really going to manifest this money is when you're doing something that you freaking love. Just be a little patient. I'm going to put that with temperance there. Be a little patient about it, Cancer. Form and structure. Solid foundation. You're building something here, dude. I think you're building a business. I think you've got a lot on your plate. You might have some debt that you're worried about, or maybe you're going into debt a little bit to start your business. But you're building a nice, solid foundation here for whatever it is you're working on. I do think you're working on a business. Either a business or you're taking on a side job. But this is more saying business here. We got shit talking about contracts and debt down here. You know, we got the masculine and then truth and expression, being able to express your true self. I think this is a business and I think this is a dream of yours. And I think you want to build it on a uh, solid structure to make it successful. And I, that's freaking awesome for you. 
going out and doing anything and growing ain't easy, man. Most businesses fail within the first year of being open. But I think you're going about this the smartest way you can. Calculated risk and building a nice solid foundation for it to stand on instead of just winging it. Good for you, Cancer. That's pretty damn nice. Chemistry, passion. Yeah, there's some more about that. More about that. Expressing your passion, expressing your true self. Having like a chemistry with the type of work you're doing. That'll bring in a lot of money. Like, I think once you're enjoying the work you're doing, the money kind of follows in a natural order. I've had it happen to me several times in my life, and I've had a lot of jobs, situations I didn't like that I felt always broken because I wasn't enjoying what I was doing. You know, but anytime I find something that I'm really enjoying, money just follows it naturally. And that's what this is about. Whether this is a business or whether this is a new career path or whatever this is to you, it's something you're passionate about. And that's where the true like monetary abundance is going to come from, which is really just a secondary bonus to going to work and enjoying what the hell you're doing every day, isn't it? Freaking awesome, Cancer. I love this, dude. This is great, man. It's freaking great. Let's uh, shake up the Astro Oracles. Get an Astro for Cancer, please. Just one of them. Just one Astro Oracle on this for my Cancer friends. Nice little spread here. Looks like Cancer's uh, starting a business, working on something they're very passionate about. I think it's freaking awesome for you, man. Love these kind of reads. I like it when my friends are rocking it out. Cancer I'm reading for right here is... Uh, might be a little worried, a little scared about what they're doing because it might be new to them. But it's something they're very passionate about. It says you're going to rock it out, Cancer. I love this, dude. Love it, house community. Yo, you know what? I'm just going to say it ain't no shame in asking for help. If you're like getting a loan or something to help you build your dream here, sometimes that's what we got to do, especially if it's an industry where there's going to be a large financial outlay at the beginning and there's a lot of overhead man keep trucking on cancer keep trucking on man love this for you my friend anyway if you guys enjoyed this be sure to leave a like you want to see more like this check out this video over here youtube thanks you're going to enjoy now i'll see y'all on the next one bye